Hey guys, and welcome to episode one of my snail craft. Yes, I released a video about this not that long ago, and yeah, I've had to uh, camp up up here on this tree. Um, it was night time, and yeah, I, I got scared. As you can see, there's still a skeleton. Oh, there he is. So what I'm going to do is basically, this is spawn, and you've seen on my little video, I made that crafting table just over there. So what I'm going to do is run all the way over to that. Try not to get blown up by this creeper. <laughs> oh god. And I need to gather wood basically. Now this is quite strange for me because I'm so used to playing, you know, survival maps that I've made. And we're not actually in the air or anything. So yeah. Let's just continue on doing this. Now I've still got the wood that I got from when I made the video. So let's change that. Make some sticks and make a pickaxe. That's a shovel. Oh, this is a huge flatlands. This is great. This is going to be the community sport area, I think. Okay, I need to start making some sort of signage. Um, right. Poor zombie, you just burned in front of my eyes. Now what I'm going to do is just make the worst dirt box I've ever made in my life, probably. Uh, just so I can, you know, spend the night, if you know what I mean, in there. Because obviously it's going to get night time and I haven't really got a lot of stuff. So I need to make myself a nice little chest. Uh, I'll break that. Put you in there for a minute. Make myself a door. Some more of them. Get myself a wooden sword. Um, yes, yeah, a chest. That's right. I haven't got enough wood. Okay. I just, I just noticed a bit of a bug there. This latest update, the tools don't even make a sound when they break. Okay. I barely even noticed that my shovel disappeared. Then. Hmm. Better fix that one, guys. Yay, my dirt box is ready. Hang on. Ta-da! Oh, it's so cozy. <laughs> oh my god, what is that? It's rubbish. All right, I'll put a little hole there. Put a little hole there. Another one. Here, like that. Oh no, quick, it's getting night time. Right, I need to go and find some sand. What was the cave? The first ever cave, eh? Should be enough. Right, let's go and get some stone. That little cave over there we just seen. Nice if I find some coal as well. Right, I'll gather the rest of this coal and we'll go back to our dirt house. Make some glass windows. Oh, it's quite a lot here, which is quite good. Nice. I mean, there is absolutely tons of this stuff. How is there so much? Oh no, it's turning into iron. Youch. That's a great find. God, it's just going on and on and on. Oh, I just realised I'm still using my wooden pickaxe. It's rubbish. <laughs> oh well. May as well use it, I suppose, anyway. Well, that'll do for now. I've, I've had enough. That'll, that'll be enough. Uh, back up there. I would like some butter armour, please. If I can. Yes, this uh, this uh, snail craft's on hard mode, by the way, guys. So hopefully we can get. Yes, I got my first piece of armor. Protection one. Yes, butter pants. Oh, that's so good. Still, nobody's on here with me, which sucks. Um, I don't know. 
Maybe they haven't seen this yet. Okay. Um, let's break this one. And put the furnace there. 28 pieces of coal. I did pretty good, didn't I, really? And the sand. Should we take that. Make some lovely little torches. And as I got yellow dye, I may as well make some yellow glass, right? <laughs> um, yeah, I'm going to take one of those sands because... Oops, no, I'll probably ruin that now. Right, next mission. Wow, I should make myself a stone pickaxe, really, shouldn't I? And grab that iron. I'm a bit scared. Um, oh, I need to eat as well, actually. How long's that got? A bit of a while. Well, I'm going to eat the horrible rotten flesh. Oh, the first piece didn't even give me hunger, did it? Weird. There it is. The lovely yellow stained glass. Oh my god, it's so bright, isn't it? Against that brown, it's horrible. Lovely. Butterman's house. <laughs> oh, so stupid. Right, I got some wood so I can make a chest and start storing some stuff because, yeah, it's going to become a bit messy house, isn't it? Uh, tell you what, let's break down here. Like that. Oh, and then do this. Put these here like that. And then put that like that. And I can still get in it, look. I'm still not too sure about this animation. Of opening chests. I don't know, I just can't get used to it. It's a bit weird. Oops, I shouldn't have covered that piece up. Oh yes, yeah, so how am I going to do that? Uh, right, okay. Maybe if I do that then. Like that. Bit, bit hidden, but hey ho, it's going to work, isn't it? Okay, that'll do. Bit weird. But you know me, I'm not normal, <laughs> Jake. Uh, right. Oop. So I don't want to place that. I want to chuck some stuff in here now. Um, I need to cook that piece of chicken. And get all that in there. I'm going to keep this uh, wooden pickaxe as a backup for now. Um, like I'm going to need it. Probably not. But hey hey. Chuck all these bits in here. Grab my torches. I might make two more. So that'll be eight more. I uh, don't really need that. I'll keep that. Right. Give me my piece of chicken. Right. Shall I go to the cave? My little butter pants on? <laughs> Let's try and get some iron, shall we? And try and not get ourselves killed. This is a pretty good cave, I think. I mean, it's going to be hard mining because... Uh, yeah, I haven't put the coordinates on because I feel like that's cheating. Seriously. And, yeah. I like to play this game with no coordinates. I like to work out and remember where things are. <laughs> and I need to work out that I need to be at least 12 blocks high. So, you know, I need to work out when I reach bedrock. Okay, I need to go up a bit to try and find diamonds. So basically what I'm going to do now is just grind out a load of ores I can... And yeah, I'll come back to you when I'm back at my dirt house. Or if anything else happens, like if I die or I find diamonds. Yeah. Yeah, right. Like I'm going to find diamonds already. Uh, yeah, I'll jump back to it. Oh, it's raining, look. Right, guys, I ain't got loads, but I'm kind of like breaking my tools and I'm getting a bit hungry. And I thought if it's daytime, I should go out and go and find 
Oh, there's a zombie there, look. So, let's try and find some food, basically. Oh, I've got some lovely rotten fresh again. Oh, it's a sheep, look. Now, that'd be good because I need to make a bed. So, I'm sorry, buddy. <laughs> and I want that chicken over there, seen. God, I want a fishing rod so badly. Oh, there's a creeper there, look. And how come that skeletons are not getting burned? Is it because it's raining? Cool, second sheep. One more now. One more and I can make a nice yellow bed. <laughs> uh, oh, is that one? No. I don't want to go too far. I'm going to get lost house. A lot of trees around here, which is good. Thing with me, though, I've got a really bad habit of just running around, and that's where my hunger's going, right? <laughs> yeah. Maybe I shouldn't run around too much. There's a cow, look. Oh, look, there's a sheep there, look. Nice. Awesome. Well, let's kill him. We're walking to him, guys. <laughs> yes, now I can make a bed. Cool. I'll kill this little horse as well. Hopefully I'll get some leather. Yep. Always handy. And there's my little hut. Right, let's go and cook up some bits. Make a bed. A nice yellow one. Me and my butter. There we go. Butter bed. <laughs> oh god, what is going on? This is so funny. Oh, that's great. Cool, I got food. Nice. Um, let's turn that into orange. And realistically, I should keep on with the yellow theme. But I need to make a cauldron for this. Oh my god. This is going to be expensive. Let's turn these coal into blocks. Um, yeah, let's put that away for a minute. And that, and that. The cobblestone. Yeah, I might make a, um, a cobblestone... Uh, where is it? A stone sword and a stone axe for a minute. Make myself a stone hoe. Oops. Not orange dye can go in there, look. Cool. Right, quick, because it's still raining. I shall do one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. Oops. Cool. Now I just need to go and get a bucket and fill that with water. That is my next mission. Smelt down all this iron I've got. So what I'm going to do is chuck that in there. I should put my little helmet on I've made. It's all good. Don't need that, don't need that. Right, let's grow that. Two seeds. Yay. Right, let's go and get my water. Oh, it's only here, look. <laughs> that wasn't very far, was it? Okay, cool. Put that back in there for a minute. Now, I'm going to make a cobblestone generator because I'm mental and I would rather just grind at a cobblestone generator to get cobble then actually go dig for it, if that makes sense. I know I'm going to end up with loads of cobble anyway, but for the start, I think that's a good idea. Um, right, I want to make myself a pickaxe. That's what I said I wanted to do. There it is. And like the same with that. Once that's broke, I'll use that. Right, I can't... The thing with this game, I don't know if I can change the settings on here. 
Probably not, but I don't know. I don't think that smells, so let's have a look. So we've got three in there now, and if I go quite far away, I think it stops working, right? So let's go, I don't know, let's just, uh, let's go and punch some trees down and come back and see if I actually, if that's gone more than three, because I don't think it does. Oh look, there's another golden zombie. Oh my god, I want to kill him. Here he is, guys. Let's get him. Come on. Drop something. Yes, the helmet! Oh, I'm going to be able to get... Oh, there's a spider there. There's a spider there. Yes. I want string. Oh, there's two. I want string. Give me that string. Come on. Oh no, it fell in. Did I get any string? No. Come on, two pieces of string. Oh, he's got an iron shovel, that one. Nope, none. Iron shovel, come on. <sighs> Man. Any more spiders? Oh, he's got a nice helmet on. To be fair, I should be killing these skeletons because I want... Oh, he's just give me a bow. Thank you very much. Because I want... Um, they're bones, obviously, to get bone meal, so I can grow this wheat. He's got an enchanted bow. No way. And I've got it. Oh, that's pretty good. I swear I haven't got looting on, guys. <laughs> Spider there. Look. Oh, no, he's coming, that creeper. Oh, this is scary. There he is. I could use that, actually. There we go. Come on, I want this. I just want some string. Oh wow, I just got an achievement. Uh, real. It's telling you, I am actually playing this on pure survival, guys. And I'm actually getting achievements, which is pretty cool. Um, so I got a spider, right? Still no string. <sighs> Come on. I tell you what, I'm gonna go sleep, guys, and. If there is spiders, they will stay there, won't they? So, why the hell not? Right, this is setting my spawn. Come on, I want to get a fishing rod before Lister does. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> I know Lister's a big fisherman like myself on this game. There is creepers everywhere. <gasps> I thought there was one behind me then. God, where's my crew? Where, where's the team that backed me up here? Oh. That was a bit weird. Just talking about that. And, uh, what's this? Hey, Dan, I just wanted to ask. When do you plan to start the realm? Snail crab. Sounds awesome, by the way. Maybe you could do a regular Let's Play episodes on the channel. Ah, oh, thanks very much. <laughs> You've made it into episode one. And it started right now. It started since I released the video. Um, but yeah. I can't pronounce your name, I'm afraid. Kyluxkia Luna. Thanks very much for that little message, dude. Legend. Um, I'm still looking for a spider. <sighs> now, I'm tempted to kill a couple more shoes because I don't know. If like Lister joins or something, I can make him a bed pretty quickly. I don't want to be, like, hateful against my teammates. <laughs> We're all going to work together. That's the idea. Um, uh, that's just a black horse. There's a witch over there. What the hell? I'm sorry. Is that your mummy? <laughs> Die! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm not a crazy, uh, psychotic um, hyena. <laughs> Jakes. <laughs> That ain't following me now, is it? No, okay. Phew. Okay, so I guess no uh, spiders survived the night then. <sighs> Looks like this is probably still going to beat me and get a fishing rod, doesn't it? Anyway, I killed a couple of skellies. Let's grab the bone meal that I should have got from them. Yep. And let's do this. And let's start this farm coming on a bit. God, there's so much to do. 
<laughs> it's great actually playing a normal survival world. I mean, it's like it's like I'm playing on Skyblock, you know, starting off, but I mean, a million times easier, I guess. <laughs> that's the best way of explaining it, I guess. Um, so that's kind of growing at the moment. So I'm hoping when some people join, you know, we, we've got a bit of food to start us off because, yeah. As I'm the ringleader, as I'm the owner of the realm, I thought I should better start a little farm up because people are going to get hungry, aren't they? But like I say, this is a pretty big flatland. Um, so yeah, we ain't really going to be starving because there is animals spawning like mad. So. so at the time of recording, I've just got a, a message from a guy called Forge Logical. Now, I've known this guy for quite a while. And yeah, you are more than welcome to join right now, Teach. <laughs> I'm going to actually invite you. I don't know if this is going to work, is it? Online friends. Those two are online, but what are they doing? Stan, why are you playing Clicker Heroes? What on earth is that? Right, I need to um, find Forge Logical. I don't think I've got him as a friend. No. Okay, let's do this. Find someone. Forge Logical. I think his name's going to be that on here, surely. Yep, there we go. So I'm going to add you as a friend, sir. He does just Minecraft content. I've seen him do a couple things, like Lego Worlds and stuff. So I've added him as a friend. So let's invite. So that should be that. And now I can add a Realm member. Go on there. He's currently messaging me right now. <laughs> He's asking me. There he is. Look. Let's invite him. There we go. Save changes. Cool. So that means I've got nine members right now at the time of recording. I still want another... Well, I want it to be 13 in total. Because 13's unlucky, right? But I'm an idiot and I feel like 13 is a good number because say like, well, I know for a fact that Forge Logical is American. Kit and Kills is American. So they're going to be on this different times, you know. So, and the same with uh, Fatal Confusion. He's American as well. Whereas me, Lister and Stan and that, we all live in England. Well, I currently live in France, but it's the same EU in it pretty much until Brexit. <laughs> but yeah, you know what I mean. 13 is a good number because if people are away, you know, other people can join, etc. But like I said, I don't know how big this is going to be. It would be nice if it got pretty big. Now that iron's actually done and I stupidly forgot to go and check it, didn't I? Idiot. Oh well. Um, I'm going to put my leather helmet that I made earlier on in here because I don't really need it. Uh, I need to make some sort of sign here because I need to warn people this is my scary house. Jake, it's not scary. Um, let's make a couple of these and let's get some signs on the go. Let's do this. So this is going to be Dan Rob's props. Can I do it like this? Dan Rob's props is? I think I can. Cool. Uh, dirt hut, right? I'm just going to put, please. Oh no, there's a creeper. Oh. My lovely dirt heart. <laughs> uh, how the hell didn't I die? I mean, that protection one actually saved me, didn't it? I could just hear his footsteps. So I was like... Is that Forge Logical? <laughs> oh, God. Wow, I didn't die, I suppose. Um, great. Let's put my bed back. Is that right? Yeah, I think so. 
pork chop. Oh my god. Well, that is a really hard achievement to get, right? <laughs> wow. You can tell I'm, uh, I've only been playing this on creative. And obviously with add-ons and cheats and stuff. Yeah. I mean, that just shows, doesn't it? <laughs> that I don't really play survival very often. Um, I might as well just get rid of that. Pointless. Right, I want to grab some iron and let's make myself a nice shiny iron shovel because I need to go and get some dirt thanks to a stupid creeper and it's becoming night time so I need to be quick here. Let's just take it from here. Right, let's try this again, shall we? Is there any creepers around? No. Right. And then I wanted to write, please laugh. <laughs> and then XD. That's it. Ha 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 ha. Jakes. Anyway, guys, I'm going to end the episode there. Um, just because I need to get to work on this now. Because, um, yeah. I, I need to uh, talk to people and stuff. Huh? <laughs> I'm not a businessman. I've just uh, got my butter helmet on. Wait, what the hell's going on there? Look at that. Look in the left corner. X-ray. Why can I see through the wall? <gasps> what the? Okay. That's a bit of a cheat. What the? Oh my god. No, I can't. I can't kind of see. Okay. Anyway, guys, I'm going to end it there. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Daryl's Props. Catch you next time. Bye.